Hi, this is Nancy to Crohn's Intuition. And lately I haven't been doing much content on my channel because I have been furiously working, <laughs> getting my sacred space organized. I got some new shelves and um, I, I have had the, the most wonderful time just organizing everything, but I must admit it was a huge job <laughs> because um, I have a lot of stuff, always have, probably always will. It's just part of my DNA, what can I say? But anyhow, I wanted to share my sacred space with you. And so uh, Agador and I have made a video uh, showing my sacred space and um, here it is. So without further ado, here is a tour of my sacred space. Uh, before I actually enter, I wanted to show you uh, Ruby and Edwin, who are going to be part of my Halloween decorations. They are animatronics. Um, and, you know, every crone needs a maid and a butler. Am I right? <laughs> so let's come on in. And I'm going to try and show you everything. I don't, I don't know how possible this is, but I have all my tarot decks on this side. And I will just take you down. Um, I have my, my Marseille decks here and my moon decks on this shelf. Uh, back up here, this is just, um, how I place these. Let me go down a little bit further. Whoop. And then on the very bottom, there we go. I don't wanna make you dizzy, so I'm gonna try and <laughs> do this gently, okay? My son got me the Hocus Pocus Witches last Christmas. Uh, this is a junk journal that I made. Here's some more of my tarot decks. And Groot watches over them. <laughs> This is my nighttime wand. Sometimes I take it and put it in my bedroom. And another wand that I made. And down here are my tarot decks in a tin and some others. Um, I have a few things down here. Um, some of my books that I have. This is where Agador lives. And he came out and flew and landed on me, so I um, stopped the video until we could get organized. But Agador, can you say hello? Can you say hello, boo? Agador Spartacus is my, oh, he loves my phone. <laughs> okay, come on, let's come over here on my finger. All right, let's see. Um, I showed you this. So now we'll go to the next uh, shelf. Um, I collect Buddhas and um, these are still my tarot decks. I have all the tarot decks on the left side of my room as I enter. And a lot of the, uh, the different tarot books that I have. Um, here are some of my crystals. Let's get on my shoulder, Agador. Come on, there you go. Try and get in closer here so you can see them. Um, this container here, um, 
is full of all the love letters that my father sent to my mother when he was in England, in France, in Germany during World War II. Um, he landed on Utah Beach on Normandy on D-Day. It's another Buddha. Um, this is getting close to my apothecary over here. And, um, oh, one thing I did want to show you. Um, this, this, these are my rune collections. Uh, Kristen Louise's deck is close to my desk because I use it really often, her rune deck. Um, I do have this beautiful fan, but I cannot swap it like Gerald does, so I've got it up here where I can enjoy it and see it. Let your soul speak. This is my apothecary. And I have all of my nature decks right here. This is an altar. Over here is another one of my Buddhas. I love this. Let whatever you do today be enough. My window on the world. Oh, here comes Agador back, trying to get on my phone. He loves my phone. Okay, let's see. Over here, um, these are paintings that I purchased from Heather. Um, indigo, Jaguar, Tarot, and I'm not sure I have a terrible time. I should know, I should know the name, her name, but I just know she's my, my good friend, Heather. Um, here are my, um, my, my beautiful, um, Lemurian quartz and, uh, record keepers. This is a little moss garden that I have here and my dragon lights up. Uh, there's a Nala, my crystal dragon. Okay, Agador's going to fly around a little bit. I have um, all of my chakra decks here in books. Some more books. Some more guidebooks, storage, uh, my Kanjo that um, Liesel from Cigar Box Guitar gifted me. Uh, here I have my rain stick and a didgeridoo. I don't know if you all have heard a rain stick or not, but... it back. Over here are my oracle decks. And my little spaceman that makes the, uh, the starlight on the um, wall and ceiling. More of my oracle decks. As you can see, I have quite a few. What can I say? The struggle is real. More oracle decks. These are my divine feminine decks here. Up here uh, are my nature decks, bird decks. Down here are my angel decks.
My youngest son made this mask when he was in high school. These are my shamanic decks. Down here are just um, some varied decks that I have. Uh, in this box with the, the clouds on it are my um, essential oils. And over here is my desk. Up there is a smoking billet uh, that Ginger read for me. We created it. She taught me how to do it. Some more books. Kuan Yin. Let's see here. Agador is back in his cage. Now, um, I went with my son to look at Halloween decorations and uh, these little taco trays, they're made of metal. They were on clearance. There, you got two for, um, it used to be $9.99, but I got them for $4.99. And my son thought I was crazy. And I said, I'm going to put tarot decks in it when I'm, the, the decks that I'm working with. And look how perfectly it works. You know, they're not sliding around. I can just take out the decks um, that, um, that I'm working with. Uh, this is the newest deck that I, I purchased. Stranger Things. I loved that series. Can't wait for the fourth season to come out. The decks that I'm working with, um, here is the, um, the Elemental Path. The She Tarot. The Chinese Five Element Oracle. The Fifth Tarot. The Ethereal Tarot by Vixen. And this beautiful um, Healing Spirit uh, deck that I was gifted by the beautiful Amanda um, at um, Oh, let's see. What's the name of uh, Tropical Empress? Yes. Um, I got a reading recently from Ginger Fay, and this was one of the cards that she pulled for me. This was another one. And this was my card of the day, my oracle of the day yesterday. The light in you can lead the way. I love that. Um, this, uh, navy, uh, cloth, whoop, that has the birds on it is my, 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 uh, sacred tears cloth. Um, um, shadow reader Hershey, uh, told us about how she uses this cloth, not this one, but she has one that was her grandmother's sacred tear cloth. And when you have happy tears, not sad tears, but when you have happy tears, um, I tend to, to cry when I connect with spirit and my team uh, because I'm just so overcome with the power of it. And I use, I use that, that towel to gather my sacred tears. Um, I love burning incense. I do that <laughs> pretty much constantly when I'm in here. Some of my dried flowers. And over here, I got this cute little spider web. Isn't that adorable? Uh, here's my laptop. And um, these are the decks that I'm currently working with. Um, I love the Cantagee Oracle. Uh, and then here are some of my books. I recently got this one. You know, Amazon was having Prime Day. And I was just absolutely thrilled because, let me show you here, wait a minute, I want to make you dizzy. There. This is the neatest book. And what I'm doing is I am 
um, recording things that are important to me. And I love the big pages. Um, let's see, back here I did uh, something that I recently read during um, our Monday Divine Feminine Day. But um, this is pretty much my world, my sacred space. Um, and I just wanted to share it with you. I, I wanted you to see what I've been doing. I finally, finally have it organized. And I had so much fun doing it, but I must admit, <laughs> it was a big job. So, this is Nancy at A Crone's Intuition wishing you many, many blessings. Namaste, my precious friends.